All right, guys, so as you can see, we are here at Hogan's Beach Shop. Yeah. And it is right across the street from the world's biggest McDonald's. Yep. Yeah. Right here there. In Orlando, Florida. On International Drive. Yep. Yeah. So if you like McDonald's, be sure to check it out. I hear it has <laughs> the biggest playpen. So I think it's kind of cool to see, actually. And can I just say that red and yellow is running wild here at Hogan's Beach Shop? And right across the street at the world's biggest McDonald's. It's awesome. amazing. Yeah. All over. Here we have Hollywood Hulk Hogan. Looks just like his Ultimate Edition Series 7 figure, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. That's an awesome figure. It is. It's really cool. Ultimates. Yeah, yes. for me too, actually. Yeah, it's a great figure. It's a great it figure. Is. Here we have more Hollywood Hulk Hogan. And we have Hollywood Hulk Hogan and King Kong Bundy in the cage. From WrestleMania 2. Entrance, <laughs> obviously. Um, WrestleMania 6, Hulk Hogan and the Ultimate Warrior. Wow. And then right here, WrestleMania 3, Hulk Hogan and Andre the Giant. Where he became a legend. Yep, the body slam heard around the world. And that's right. Yep. So, welcome everyone to Hogan's Beat Shop. Yes, welcome. Good, how are you? Thank you. Oh my God, this is so cool. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder if they let anyone get in there and bump. <laughs> That's so pretty cool. Yeah. And the uh, Hulk Hogan elite figure is forty dollars here at Hogan's Beach Shop. But you get to say you got it at Hogan's Beach Shop. Yeah, I did. Yeah. <laughs> and the basic figures are eighteen dollars here at Hogan's Beach Shop. Let's we'll zoom in now. in the retail, honestly. No, not really. Great place to come on vacation. And here he is. Yeah, <laughs> here he is. Here's the Thunderlips. So in case you guys didn't know, this is Hulk Hogan as Thunderlips from the Rocky movie. Yeah. He might want those. Uh oh. I might yeah. have to give him a test. And that's what he 29. Nice. WrestleMania 7 t shirt I've been wearing, so I think I made the right choice. Yeah. <laughs> Just in case you guys were wondering, it does say, please talk to me before getting in the ring, brother. <laughs> so I guess they do probably allow you in the ring, but you have to talk to the staff first. Nice. So in case you guys are wondering, Hulk does come into this store once a month. He also owns this store and the one in Clearwater, Florida. He lives in Clearwater. He still has 24 inch pythons. Those are his arms. He doesn't actually own a python. <laughs> yes, you can sign uh, you can send items to get signed. That is good to know. I might have to do that. Yeah. The restaurant in Clearwater is open. The signature is original. No, they will not give you his phone number or his address. <laughs> 
there are not specific days or times he comes in. No, they won't call him or take personal messages. Please don't do that. <laughs> no, we aren't related. No, he doesn't come in and rip his shirt off. And no, he doesn't come in and stand behind the register. <laughs> Here we have Hogan's newest figure. Well, one of his newest figures, his newest Elite, Elite 91, signed for $250. Okay, guys, so we were just talking to the staff here at Hogan's Boot Shop, and the staff here is amazing. Um, if you want to get a Hogan signed, it is $125 for the figure. And um, depending on the item, it starts at $75 and goes up to $300. But Hogan will be here in clear water doing the signing on June 25th, in case you guys are interested. What's that? And it's at 2 to 6 p.m. And you can get the tickets at hogansbeatshop.com just to be special. Here we have some championship belts for $30. They have the Tag Team Championship, the United States Championship, the WWE Championship, the Universal Championship, the White Intercontinental Championship, and the old NXT Championship, which the NXT one is 50% off here at Hogan's Beach Shop. And if you're here on vacation, they do have Hogan's Beach Shop Orlando t-shirts. These are pretty cool. Here we have some Roddy Piper plushes. We got some Macho Man. What is this? Uh, yeah. yeah, in the backpack. That's pretty cool. And then over here, we have some Hogan plushes. Nature Boy robe is pretty cool. Yes, it is. <laughs> right? Yes, <laughs> and they have the title right here. Diamonds are forever. And so is Ric Flair. Here we have a bunch of different championship belts. Yeah, like almost everything. Very cool story, yeah? Oh, we have IRS up on the TV here. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that wizard. I know, right? <laughs> Look at his ass. He needs some sleep. Yes, he does. <laughs> off off the side of the road and try this fruit stand and it looks really good we just tried some of the fruit and she was able to give us samples it was really good so i would definitely recommend if you guys are out here to give it a try it's on us 192 um yeah but so far so good it was really tasty thank you So now, guys, we're going to stop into Barnes & Noble. I'm going to check out some of the Harry Potter collection. Yeah. See if it's anything new. So for any of you who are actually Lego collectors or you're interested in building Legos, don't sleep on Barnes & Noble. They have a lot of the really good ones that are hard to find and like Target's or other stores. Um, to be honest, I've only ever seen this one located at the Lego store in Disney Springs. So here you have the Wizarding World of Harry Potter wand collection. So if you want to get these wands, they're also sold on noblecollection.com. If you get them from there, they're actually, I believe, $40. And you do get an Ollivander's box with them. 
But hey, if you want to save 10 bucks, go to Barnes & Noble and check it out. Yeah, right? <laughs> Today, I'm going to pick up my copy of The Tales of Beetle the Bard. <laughs> it is pretty cool, it but is. we still have to put together our Disney Castle one. I know, I know. We have to put it back together since we've moved. Yeah, yeah I got to do that first. We got to do that first. <laughs> yeah. We built it one time, but we got to build it again. We do, we do. They also have the um, regular Nintendo. Oh, that's awesome. guys no stop to Barnes & Noble would be complete if we didn't stop for a chocolate chip cookie nope. <laughs> so we have the book we have the cookies so guys now we're on our way to stop into Whole Foods and don't worry I'm still gonna be doing my cooking videos I just had to order some plates for plating um, I did get my plates from Crate and & Barrel and I will do a review on them whenever I receive them which should be sometime next week, so stay tuned. All right, guys, so this is what we picked up and we're gonna head out now.